At UC Health last year, we broke our all-time record for solid organ transplants, which includes liver, kidney, pancreas, and heart, by doing over 300 transplants. Our program is nationally recognized for research and payer donation network in immunosuppressive medications. Some of the most important innovations have been improvements in immunosuppression that have led to a reduction in the toxicities and the side effects, but also importantly into improving rejection rates. After the initial transplant procedure is completed, the journey for a lifelong successful transplant has only just begun. At UC Health, we're the only academic medical center in the region. And so patients should come here, especially for something as complicated as transplant, because you need a coordinated team, you need specialists. There are a variety of different disciplines that participate in the care of a transplant patient at UC Health. And that includes not just a surgeon, it includes medical doctors, pharmacists, transplant specialized nurses, nutritionists that are transplant trained, infectious disease doctors. Transplant pharmacists are uniquely educated to understand the immunosuppressants that are required to give the patients so that their transplant survives as long as they live. That type of resource is needed and really can only be found at an academic transplant center. And I'm really proud to say that I work as part of a great team. Our community clinics uh, are spread all across uh, the state of Ohio, Indiana, Kentucky, and we bring an advanced level of care to the patient in their backyard, and I'm proud that we are able to provide the best care for kidney disease, transplant, and liver disease to all our patients in this whole region. The University of Cincinnati has a long history of transplant clinical research. For 50 years, Transplant investigators at the University of Cincinnati have been pioneering new approaches for transplantation. We believe that it's absolutely critical that patients in our region know that we have a comprehensive academic transplant program here. And families need to understand that they don't need to go anywhere.